Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. First of all, I'd like to say thank you for all of the wonderful comments, uh, for your prayers, uh, for the subs. I was so surprised to see I had 15 one day and two days later I've got 90. So thank you so much for that. Thank you for your encouragement. I really appreciate it. Uh, so today I want to talk about what is metastatic breast cancer. So first off, what's breast cancer? Well, it would be on simple terms, I'm not a doctor. Um, in the breast, you would have your main tumor. So metastatic breast cancer means that it has traveled through either the lymph nodes or through the bloodstream and gone somewhere else in the body. So you can have breast cancer in your liver, you can have breast cancer in your bones. Um, I know it's a strange concept if you've never had to think about that before, but that's pretty much the way that it works. So that's what I wanted to talk about today. Very quick, very simple. So metastatic breast cancer is breast cancer that has traveled from the breast to another part of the body. So in my case, it went through the bloodstream. Um, at first, it, upon initial diagnosis, it was actually metastatic breast cancer. So one year mammogram, I was fine. The next year, there was a lump. So please do your mammograms, check for lumps, do whatever you can. And um, yeah. That's the best advice I can give you there. So get your checkups. Um, so the liver cleared up, totally clear. Um, it responded really well to the initial chemo, which was awesome. A year later, we found it in my left hip. So we had treatments for that and those worked, which was really good. So now what has happened is wherever it was in the hip, you get a random cancer cell that doesn't get killed or or put to sleep it can travel wherever it wants so that's what we're looking at now um, I put a question out there on uh, Facebook and I was asking people if they knew anyone who had been on pills before uh, it really helps to share your story with people if you're going through any sort of um, chronic condition because it helps people. When you're not alone, it makes such a huge difference. People to talk to, compare notes with, with I beg your pardon. <clears throat> so yeah. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Um, if you want to subscribe, it really encourages me. It's, I know it might seem like a strange thing, but it does. Uh, and I thank you all for your support. Um, and if you have any questions or comments or any of your own stories that you want to share, please put them in the comments below. Um, if you've got questions, I will answer as many as I can. So thank you very much. Um, and we'll see you later, guys. Thanks. Bye-bye.